What is going on guys, it's Declan here and today I'm going to be showing you guys two player launch glitches for Grand Theft Auto Online. So these two glitches basically enable your character to go completely flying into the air. Definitely one of those funny moments type of glitches that you can show to your friends and definitely have fun with. I know I had so much fun with this and I was doing it by myself. As you can see my character does some weird shit while he's in the air wobbling his hands all about. Definitely one of those funny glitches so if you guys do go on to enjoy today's video make sure you hit that like button down below. Once again can we try to shoot for something well over 500 likes that would be awesome and with that said let's begin so starting this off the first thing you want to do is come to this location on the map it is just outside of the four hundred thousand dollar apartment as you can see right there on the map and there is two gates here like so so what you want to do is simply push open this gate until it is wide open then what you want to do is take cover by this wall until the gate starts going crazy so as you can see the gate is now going crazy and then what you want to do is poke your head out of the gate if you can now that basically speeds up the process and as you can see any second now it will send me flying into the air and this glitch is hilarious. I definitely had fun while doing this as you can see my character does start spazzing out. He does some crazy ass dance in the air. It's almost like the new Harlem shake. I mean this is just crazy. I don't know what my character is doing at this point. And that is pretty much how you do the glitch. It's pretty much self explanatory. There is the better version which is the two player version as you can't die from that. You actually go flying in the air and when you come back down you do not die. Whereas with the solo method I'm showing you now you do actually die when you land. But it is still very funny as you just saw there my character was going crazy. And once again I'm going to be showing you guys that. So once again just simply push the gate open like so then take cover. And if the gate does not go crazy the first time simply push it open again. Then take cover once again and maybe even point your face to the left and then simply point it to the right afterwards. I'm not entirely sure if that does help but you can try that anyway. And as you can see as you're poking your head out of the gate it will eventually send you flying back into the air. Now sometimes guys you can actually die. I tried this around four to five times and I died once but I know that you can die quite a lot from this but sometimes you will go crazy like this and this is absolutely insane. As you can see my character now starts spinning around at like 100 miles per hour. I was indeed dying in laughter when I actually saw this the first time. I never actually saw anything like this before. It just looks absolutely Absolutely insane when he's spinning around like this so it's definitely one of those funny glitches you can do and I'm now going to be showing you guys the better version of this the one where you can't die when you land it does require two people to do but it is definitely the funnier and better version of this glitch so all you want to do to achieve this is simply have one player walk up to the gate like so and take cover exactly where I do do not push the gate open just take cover by the gate exactly where I am now and then have your friend either walk into the gate or run into the gate and he will go absolutely flying. This is much easier to do guys. Literally your friend all he has to do is just walk into it. He can even drive into it as well as you're going to see very shortly. All he has to do there is just drive into the gate and his car will go absolutely flying as you just saw there. This is definitely one of the funniest glitches on GTA. You know you can show your friends and have fun with this. And as you can see now from my perspective when I run into the gate as I Crazy Teddy is taking cover exactly where I was a minute ago. I go flying into the air so as you can see you can either run or walk into it and you just catapult straight into the air like so you keep going higher and higher and you can even get sent across the map not just high into the air you can literally get sent into so many different places with this and the best part about this is when you come back down you don't die which makes it that much funnier you can literally you can try to land on someone's head as you can see I took no damage whatsoever or I might have took a little bit of damage I don't know I'm not too sure but literally guys you do not die when you do this you can even experiment with this as you can see I actually end up jumping off a car into the gate and it does end up sending me all the way into the parking lot. This glitch is absolutely insane, definitely one of the funniest glitches and I'm actually a little bit late on this, not many YouTubers actually posted the solo method so I thought I'd go ahead and post the solo method alongside the better method as well as I didn't actually post this to you guys when I should have. Nevertheless, I'm going to leave the commentary there, so if you did enjoy, be sure to hit that like button down below, guys. Once again, can we try to shoot for something well over 500 likes? That would be awesome. And if you guys want to go ahead and follow us on Twitter, you can do that at 2DynamicHD. We are always trying to interact with you guys on there and keep you up to date on what we're going to post next. Anyway, with that said, I will see you all in the next video.